Yo, what's good, YouTube? It's your boy Moody. Back with some more JBA action. Um, this place this week we are playing FC Byron Metagross, coached by Germany's own Mix. Um, little history in JBA. Um, I played Mix twice. This is the third time I played him. Uh, I am 2 and 0 against him in JBA. Um, both of those games were very close. I won on a um, like I had to hit two stone edges in one of the game. The other game, which is like pretty much down to the wire, got a little late game scully sweep, but um, it was really close regardless. Um, but yeah, Mix is really good, really good battler. He drafts really good teams too, and his team that he has is pretty scary. Um, so let's get into it. So he's rocking out with Mega Altaria, Infernape, Ferrothorn, Porygon 2, um, Latios, and Ditto. So, um, and what am I rocking out with? I am rocking out with the Witch Core. The Witch Core cometh. Yes, the Witch Core is here and debut uh, game together. I mean, obviously, Crest and Mandibuzz has been on the team, but Clef, the new addition. Um, so yes, we have Rita Repulsa, the Cresselia, we got Leandra, the Clefable, um, we got Crank Anchors, the Mandibuzz, uh, we have Westchester, the Sneasel, uh, we got Weapon X, the Charizard X, and then we got JSA, the, uh, Verizion. So, J uh, Verizion is Special Attacker, um, sp uh, Special, uh, Special Choice Set Attacker, uh, Leandra is actually Max HP, Max Defense, um, bold, uh, calm mind, moonblast, flamethrower, and soft boiled, and it is um, life orb, magic arc. Uh, crest is max defense, max HP, with psychic, moonblast, um, I think calm mind, and moonlight, I think. And then uh, Mandibuzz is roost, defog, knockoff, U turn, pretty standard stuff. And Sneasel is, I think Sneasel is Ice Blue Crash, um, Knock Off, Ice Shard, and Poison Jab, I want to say. And then Charizard Y is, or not Charizard Y, Charizard X, <laughs> what am I, I'm just, just talking about Charizard Y. Uh, Charizard X is the uh, Dragon, or not Dragon Dancing, um, Substitute, uh, Flare Blitz, Dragon Claw, and um, Roost. So yeah, so uh, on this team, four of my mods can recover, have a reliable recovery, which is actually kind of cool to think about. It. Like four of my mods can recover up and are fat and re hit hard. I got three potential six O sweeping mods and Crest, um, but Fable and Charizard X. But uh, yeah, so assessing the threats on this team, the Ditto is annoying as fuck. I hate playing Ditto teams. Like I just hate. It's just like annoying. It's just like one of those things you have to like worry about. Um, that's why I didn't put Dragon Dance on Charizard X because if he, if he like stole the, like a Dragon Dance and you know if he was Ditto, most Ditto's are ran Scarf, so if he stole the Dragon Dance, he could kill me with Dragon Claw and then proceed to probably wreck my whole team. Um, so it's not that good. Uh, Latios is a, a potential problem as well, but I do have Sneasel. Oh no, I put Pursuit, not Poison Jab on the Sneasel. I put Pursuit. That's what I put. But yeah, so Pursuit. Um, Sneasel can come in and really revenge Lottie pretty well. Uh, Clefable. Clefable has a really good matchup on this team. It, it beats the Mega Altaria, beats the Ferrothorn, beats Porygon 2, it beats Latios. Um, it can beat Infernape, depending on what the Infernape set is. But um, uh, Infernape can kind of beat Clefable a little bit, um, it, depending on what concept kind of it wants to go. And then against Ditto. Whew, sorry, guys. It was pretty late. Um, against Ditto, um, it doesn't. Life Orb Clef doesn't. Life Orb Calm Mind Clef does not lose to a Choice Scarf Ditto uh, for this reason because when you're copying. When, when you're a Ditto and you're. You know, you're a Choice Scarf Ditto, you're going to add speed. You can't boost up on the Calm Minds and outboost the Clefable. And then also, like with Calm Mind, like Ditto's not a good Calm Mind counter sweeper. Because it's basically you're basically hitting with a moonblast at neutral, 
And then so I beat it one by one, one on one, because I'm life orb and the ditto can't copy the life orb. So the life orb actually, I'll do more damage to the ditto, is what I'm trying to say. Um, yeah, but the ditto is just like annoying. Like, the ditto is just annoying, man. Kind of, it got, because he had the ditto, it forced me to run substitute on the Charizard X, which I did not want to run. I wanted to run uh, Dragon Dance for like Porygon 2. And just like Latios and shit like that. Um, but look at his team. I think he's just going to lead uh, Infernape right now. And so I'm deciding to lead uh, the Cresselia. And what do you know? I get the matchup. So right here, I just go for a Psychic. He goes for the U-turn. That's perfectly fine. He goes into the Ferrothorn. See, I actually thought he was going to get up rocks right here with um, with Infernape. Or I thought what he was trying to do to the Cresselia would be to stay in, take the Psychic, take really big damage, and then Endeavor. Endeavor on me. And then Revenge kill me with something else. I thought that would have been kind of cool. That's what I kind of was thinking. And I was just like really thinking to myself like, if I kill this Infernape, Clef, Clef will win this game. Um, like I, I don't, I mean like Clef could potentially still win this game, but Clef, like without the Infernape, like it, it's gonna, it, it's gonna have a really good shot at sweeping. Um, so yes. So I go right into the uh, Weapon X. He gets me on the Predict and goes into, or gets me with the Toxic. Kind of sucks. Uh, I set up a sub here. I don't know why I set up a sub, to be honest. <laughs> I was like, I probably should have just Flare Blitz right off the rip instead of taking like unnecessarily 25%. I just had to Roost. He breaks the sub with the tri attack. So basically a sub was pointless, except for racking up Toxic <laughs> style damage. I Flare Blitz. It does less than 50. And I'm like, fuck. All right, I'm probably going to die. Um, I kind of just save Weapon X just for like one Flare Blitz on the, uh, on the, um, uh, Ferrothorn, just in case it gets to that point. He goes for the cover on my, uh, Clefable switch, and then he Thunder Waves, uh, Thunder Waves is just annoying as fuck. He, uh, paralyzes me. He sets up a sub, sub Porygon 2. This is pretty cool. Um, but at this point I've seen Recover, Tri-Attack, Thunder Wave, and did I see another wave? Did I see another move? I don't, I don't really remember. Or, right, well, whatever. I'm just calm mining up right here. Because why not? This, I'm calming mine again. This try attack is not doing shit to me. This try attack is doing very, very little. So I calm mine. I get the plus three. And he continues try attack. He gets a crit right there, which is you know kind of scary. But I actually went for the soft load right there. Um, he just continues to go for try attacks. Um, I'm cool with that. I stopped boosting, to be honest, because I... And I got paralyzed, but I thought boosting because I just like in the back of my head I had this like weird like ditto kind of like reverse sweep kind of nonsense in my head I go for the boom 42% on the resist. It's pretty strong. He goes for the yard ball. I'm I'm paralyzed So it's not doing that much. I flamethrower that thing is dead um, Now he goes into the ditto and then what I was referring to earlier like does 28% like whatever um, He's gonna go for two moon bliss get the paralyzed um, I just soft boiled right here and you know just continue to soft boil until I get the fall or close to it um, And then I saw a moon blast right there and see it's doing more to him because I have this life orb on this Leandra. I decided to soft boil um, He actually runs out of moon blast and That's cool. He's and he's just gonna struggle himself to death um, I think I just set up a calm mine right here. Yep, so I'm at 96% at uh, plus uh, times two special attack times three special defense. Um, it's not looking good for him, honestly. <laughs> it's, it's not looking good. So I moon blast. I do shit on the Porygon too. And Porygon too is fat as fuck. So I, I decided to calm mine even more. There's really nothing stopping me from calm mining. Um, that try attack didn't do anything um, at this point. The only way he could win is by crits. And I mean, he's not gonna get. Any. <laughs> I mean, well, he's gotta get some. But even a crit, like crits, not doing that much to me. He actually gets. Um, like, yeah, so he got, within three moves, he got two crits, and so, he's getting pretty lucky, but it's still not killing me. That's why I, tra well, that's why I picked up Clefable, like, look, at, like, this mod is fat as fuck. This mod is just putting in the work. Um, I got the special attack drop, kind of nice. Um, yeah, and, you know, this is going to be the game. This is going to be the rest of the game, like, spoilers, like, he's not going to beat this. Um. By the way, he didn't bring in the Infernape. That means told me he didn't have Gungshock. So he really couldn't do anything to me. 
but it is what it is. He calm rhymes right here. But it doesn't matter. It's dead. That that like that thing can't live. What I'm what I'm what I'm the addition. He goes right over. He does twelve percent, and he is sash. So my initial thought of the endeavor sash set was somewhat correct, but it's not gonna matter. I'm gonna take that game six zero. Um, I mean, Clefable just clear clear in away the MVP. I played like shit in, in the early game, to be honest. And then I was just like, all right, I could set up on I could set up on Porygon too. And then I just, it just the game just got out of hand from um like out of hand for mix at least. But um yeah, I mean like six zero, but I mean it happens like. Like I'm not like yo, that was easy. that was easy. Yo, look at me, it's Clefable, but like Clefable's Clefable is Clefable's a monster. All right, I can't wait to use it more in uh, a couple um, matches. So um, this this win actually secures our playoff berth. So our playoff is our playoff uh, um, spot is locked in, and we go to four and one plus fourteen. We are in first in the entire league. And then um, we're first in a division. I kind of want to get this one seed, so I got to win next week, or Cole has to lose um, for me to secure the one seed. Um, I, I hope it's just Cole loses, so I can just bring heat the next match. If Cole if Cole loses before I play, um, I'm gonna bring like I'm gonna bring some wacky shit um, or some things I always just wanted to try out. Um, I think next week we are oh yeah next week as I said in the KDL video a couple hours earlier uh, next week we were playing money and the Washington wish caches um, in the three leagues that have been gone up on this channel I beat him in DBDL he, he beat me um, spoilers if you haven't seen my KDL match but um, he beat me in the KDL uh, this which got posted a couple uh, a couple hours ago if you want to check that out uh, and um, so yeah this is like the pseudo money or uh, <laughs> I almost said money match um, but this is when <laughs> there's no money on the line I'm just playing money guy but uh, this is a uh, pseudo rubber match but yeah, well, it should be an interesting one. I do want the one seed really badly, um, so I might have to play, and that would match me up against either Toulon or or Mix. So it would be a rematch of one of Germany's finest. And um, yeah, that's about it. Um, let me know. Let me know what you guys think of the season. If uh, if you have any comments or. If you want, really curious about like what 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 was I running on certain things? Just leave a comment and make sure you drop a like. And if you are new, make sure to sub the Moody Claws. All right, uh, this is Moody, and I'll see you guys later. Peace.